hi everyone welcome back if you do not know my name is Devin here on my channel I cover all things beauty that includes makeup fragrance and designer here and there if you think that is something you'd be interested in then I hope you stay and subscribe to my channel don't forget to click the notification bell so you notify every week when I upload and in today's video I'm going to be doing a little body care haul for you guys see some of the new body care that I just recently picked up then just keep all right so I did not pick up a lot of stuff but I have been on the hunt for a couple of these things so I wanted to go ahead and share them with you all right so the very first thing that I finally was able to get my hands on is the new tree hut birthday cake scrub and body butter so if you don't know what you should by now this was hyped up so much for the last couple of weeks people were getting them in PR people were getting them early and my stores was just not having it I went to a few different targets like three or four times and no one ever had it so I was able to find it like two days before it finally released online and the target associate there was able to go in the back and pick it up for me because they still weren't out yet but I was so excited. This does say limited edition. So, I mean, if you can get your hands on it, go ahead and do that. Um, they are still available online, if I'm not mistaken, or at least they were last time I checked. But I love Tree Hut Scrubs so much. So, it was like a no-brainer. This is the birthday cake scent, as you know. Um, this does not smell like what I thought it would smell like as a birthday cake. It has a very, very, very light, like cakey scent in the background, but this smells very sweet and fruity. A lot of people are saying it smells like fruity pebbles and that is exactly what it smells like. So although it's not what I was expecting, it is still really nice. Now I have not actually used this in the shower or anything yet. I have put the cream on my hand, on my skin, and it was, it did smell really, really nice, but it's just not what I expected. I wanted something very heavily cakey. And this is not that, but it is still really good. I will put this in the shower um, and see how I like it. If I like it, maybe I'll get backups. Because you know, when they have limited edition stuff and it goes, it's gone. And then it's on Macari for arm and a leg. But I am super excited to have that. So that was a score. The next couple of body care items actually come from TJ Maxx. Um, I love the Onyx bathhouse scrubs. As you all know, I have had them in plenty of my videos. Um, if you haven't seen them, I'll try to link some of them below. But Onyx bathhouse and Tree Huts have some of the best body scrubs. But I actually like the Amina brand also. And a lot of us did not know how this brand was pronounced. It was A-M-N-H. And so that's how we would say it. But it is pronounced Amina. And I know that because they finally changed the packaging and changed the name on there. So can you see that? So they changed it from this to this way. This is the Amina Birthday Cake Sugar Polish. Now, um, I have had the Amina like whipped body polish or something like that where it's a more whipped consistency but these are actually sugar polishes so now these are a little bit more abrasive and this just smells like a light birthday cake scent a light vanilla scent but it is so freaking pretty i love this right now i am using the fruity pebbles one in the shower and it is a hit i picked that up in my last haul so i love that one and then this one is just says you melt my heart um, but it has like little ice cream cones on the side and this one smells amazing this one is super super sweet it just smells so good sweet and yummy um, not quite like ice cream but more like candy but it is good and it looks like this and again these are the sugar polishes and I like these because these are a little bit more abrasive than the regular polishes that they have. All right and the very last thing that I picked up were two fragrances that I have been searching for and if you don't know they were hyped up for a minute on Instagram and TikTok and everything. These are the Mimic Fragrance Laboratories fragrances and they look like this these from the actual mimic website actually retail for about 50 or 60 dollars and if you don't know this is kind of like a dupe house where they dupe some higher end more niche fragrances um they also have their own line of fragrances but 
we were seeing these pop up and these retail for $12.99 and this one is compound 79 a blend of cherry vanilla and wood this is supposed to be a dupe for Tom Ford's Laos Cherry. This is also a really good dupe for the Kaali Love Fest Burning Cherry. Um, these retail for $12.99. And I got to say, these are really good. I really, really, really like the two that I was able to find. Um, some people were saying they're a little bit more hyped up. But I thoroughly enjoy them. Also, if you cannot find this, because this does retail for $12.99 and they are hard to find. If you can't find this, pick up the Finery Not Another Cherry or go check out the Finery Fragrances. I do have a video on some of these, so I will link that below. But go check these out from Target. This one's a little bit more expensive. It's $27.99, but it's definitely worth the price. And I actually want to pick up a few more from this uh, line because they're great but um i was super super excited to see this so moving on the next mimic fragrance i found was compound 52 and this is a blend of sweet strawberry milk and it looks like this and this is supposed to be a dupe for melanie martinez crybaby now as you can see mine is definitely beat up scratched up it does have usage because i have been using it and it doesn't have a top this is how the bottle looked when i found it in the store it was full it was full but the paper was scratched up the nozzle was kind of twisted no top so the lady ended up giving it to me for um nine dollars which was i'm cool with that um i really like this one some people were saying it's not all that it's not worth the hype i personally really like this one and i have been wearing this with a few different fragrance combos and i've been liking it I've been getting compliments on it um, and to me it is definitely worth the $12.99 price. The Melanie Martinez, I don't think they make that anymore so I can't compare it to that because I've never had that but a lot of people were saying that this is pretty much that in a bottle so I actually really really like this one. Uh, I also really like strawberry type scents and like I said this is a light strawberry milk type scent and it smells really good. Let me just spray it again. Yeah. Yeah, it is a very light, sweet, powdery strawberry scent. So I love it. That is my little bitty haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I was super excited to find these. I cannot wait to start wearing these a little bit more. I mean, obviously, I have been wearing the heck out of this one. Like, I've been trying not to wear it. I've only worn this one one time, but that's because I've been wearing um, the finery one. So, yeah and it's just basically kind of time out for that but yeah that is it guys thank you so much for watching and i will see you in another video bye